Welcome to Virtual Discovery Day of 2020. Discovery Day is the Geological Survey of South Australia's annual geoscience conference. And this year the format is a little bit different, but we hope you're still able to engage with the program and access all the information that you want. We've tried to serve up a delicious banquet of geoscience for you to enjoy. We have registrations of over 330 people from 28 different countries, and we welcome all of you from across the globe to our conference. We sincerely acknowledge the traditional owners of the Adelaide region, the Ghana people on whose lands we live and work, and we thank their respected elder uncle Muji Sumner for his welcome to country this year. What can you expect as you make your way through the Discovery Day playlist today? Well, we have talks by our own geoscience specialists, Kate Robertson and Tom Wise, and they will give you a flavour of what we've been doing to defrost the Delamerian. Now, this is a neoproterozoic to Cambrian terrain in East and South Australia, and it's been in the, a little bit in the geoscientific freezer for a while, but new geological and geophysical data packages being put together at the moment is actually thawing out this terrain ready for a whole swag of new discoveries. And speaking of new discoveries, I've also got to talk for you about nickel potential in the Western Gawler Craton. Now this region has been simmering away with ideas about nickel potential for some time, but this year new technical success, a massive sulphide intersection, has really put the region on the front burner for new discoveries. Plus, our GSSA director, Rowan Cobcroft, gives you a taste for GSSA activities across the geoscience, across the communications, data, collaborations, and so on. So, for an overview of the geological survey, please check out his talk. And if you're into the application of machine learning and big data to geoscience problems, especially around mineral exploration, you've come to the right place. There is a discussion between our own GSSA team and Holly Bridgewater from Unearthed. And that's all around the Gawler Challenge being held this year, that was held this year, and the next stages for this cutting edge confluence of data and geoscience. Mineral exploration is a valued part of the economic mix for South Australia, and the State Government's Accelerated Discovery Initiative, or ADI, is something that all explorers and researchers will want to know more about. The Mineral Resources Division Executive Director, Alex Blood, provides you with all you need to know about this initiative, from what's been done this year to how you can get involved. And if you are still hungry after all of that, there's plenty more where that came from. We've also put together a smorgasbord of discussions on aspects of recent research and outcomes from GSSA and our collaborative partners, including the MINEX CRC, uh, CSIRO, as well as Geoscience Australia. From isotopes to databases, from minerals to portals. There's a whole lot of work going on at the moment and these conversations will hopefully give you some insight into that work and also to the people behind some of those programs. I particularly encourage you to take a look at the discussion between two of South Australia's top geoscience educators, Ros King and Tom Raimondo, and they look back at 2020 and how that has changed university geoscience education. There's definitely a lot in there that we can all reflect on. All in all, I would say it's a very balanced geoscience meal for you, full of vitamins and hopefully lots of minerals to build your geoscientific muscle. So I encourage you, please take some time, settle in, grab a coffee or tea, and just make your way through this offering. Please get in touch via all the links below, share the material and comment away. We, we can't wait to hear from you. Thank you very much for joining Virtual Discovery Day 2020. See you around soon.